Local coverage you can count on continues with Josh Ahan's Sports Report. Sports coverage you can count on. You heard it from Luther Vandross, but March is all about that one shining moment. For the Trine Thunder, that shining moment coming basically in their backyard. After marching to the D3 Final Four, Trine looked to bring home their first ever national title. Fort Wayne, feeling a little bit like South Angola, called a thunderous crowd at the Coliseum. In fact, they set a D3 title game record with over 4,500 fans in attendance as Trine takes on number one Hampton Sydney. First quarter, that's Cortez Garland pulling up for two of his 22, but Trine with a bit of a slow start. In fact, Hampton Sydney's Adam Brazil knocking down that three and Brooks Miller's squad down 25-23 at the break. But here come the Thunder. Second half, it's Drew Moore with a triple to cap off an 18-8 run as Trine is now up by eight. Now, Trine getting some contributions all across the board. That's Nate Tucker. He had 13 off the bench. Then, Aiden Smiley. All smiles after that triple. He has a dozen. Now, Hampton Sydney would eventually cut the deficit down to three. But Hampton Sydney getting thunderstruck in the final minutes. It's Fred Garland with a three. And the Thunder, your national champions for Division Three in Fort Wayne, they take care of business with a 69-61 win as Cortez Garland is named the tournament's most outstanding play uh, player. I'm ecstatic, man. Uh, they said it was a 4% chance we're going to get this done, so I guess we're an anomaly. I'm just so proud of my team, the staff, and everyone who made this possible. And, I mean, what can I say? We got it done. I feel like we've been counting out all, all year. Coach was telling us that he was getting the phone call that it might not work. But we all knew all along we all had, had a plan and everybody executed it. So I'm just very proud of my guys. Trying Thunder are national champs. Steuben County's national champs. And the Angola community are national champs. We're all national champs. Gotta love it for Brooks Miller. Trying finishing an incredible season with a 29-24 record.